Chinese cash. Hello! Then we have Chinese cash. What? The colors in this episode are going to be great, by the way, guys. This is fantastic. We did it. We, we did it. Well, yeah. inside the ant farm, guys. But also, black is beautiful. Oatmeal stout. What, what brewery is this by? You know what I'm going to say? I can't... Ethica. It's by Ethica. There you go. Prost. Prost, prost, prost. Prost, 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 prost. Oh. Do you mean Ethica, the home of Eth Acapella? Mm, that's so good. Oh, that's a good beer. Hey, how you doing? Nice talking shirt. Who got you that, by the way? Do you know? Uh, my wife. <laughs> uh, so I, uh, I'm okay. I'm a little, I, I got a little something going on, non-COVID, took the test. Sure. But I got a little something going on my throat right now. Well, I mean, it's in, in my favorite. springtime, you know, it's the changing favorite. of the... Well, yeah, I think I had like a week ago, two weeks ago, something like that, like a, it's a little something. Herpes, yeah. Throwing herpes again. Herpes and Yeah. Um, hey, you know, it's just, it's been a week. Like, it's been one of those weeks, too, that's been, like, it was gone by so fast, I'm like, what, what day is it? Yeah. I don't even know. Yeah. Uh, but, hopefully next week will be better, right? Like, it can't get worse, right? Uh, well, and your kids were home this week, right? It was spring break? Yeah, which I barely got to see them because I was working all week, so I was mm-hmm. like, so I come home, Jamie's just like, like, yeah. tie, like putting yeah. the news overhead, I'm like, no, please, no. Yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah, I'll yeah. grab them for the hour they're awake still. Smile. No, your heart is aching. <laughs> and then uh, everyone else like, oh, we took the week off because it's the kids off. I'm like, oh, you guys can do that. Cool. I did that. I'll just do your jobs while you're off. Nobody yeah, you would. Because Mike never says no. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Like if, I say, if I say no, then this doesn't get done. So. Mm. Not me. Took the whole week off. How you guys doing? I didn't. I didn't take the week off. I have been training in my job. I'm starting to do Uh, some job. Yes. And I love it. Yeah. She picked up some rocks. She lifted a box. Yep. While she sit on her head. Mm -hmm. But I won't forget what Yoda said. Yeah. So how's it going though? Are you enjoying it? I really I really enjoy it. I I love all the people I'm working with. Um I like the no, job itself. This is for uh, this is for your like the web manager for Wiki feed, correct? No, just, just exactly. Like feed, I skipped feed. right over the showing, and now I just manage. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so the, the I, mean, I think you're yeah, yeah. I think you're like a special event feed anyway, because yeah, you're yeah, so yeah, exactly. small. Exactly. Like it's like people are going to be into that. Like elf feet. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Elven, yeah. elven. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, you spit those toes in. You should clench them up. You know, you, you know dipping, the dipping, the term. Yeah, dipping and dipping and popping. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm telling you that Dan Harmon's podcast it's, it's a good place to learn about foot feathers <laughs> stocking play everything everything's all in there Dan Harmon dipping I love how it. y'all like mention it like you've never checked it out like no I'm not, I'm not I've sure. never checked it out I've never yeah. and that's saying something because I've been down some rabbit holes yeah yeah no, I, I, I will agree with that part but yeah like I have no, I'm like when he's doing a pop, it makes me laugh every time because I've never heard that. Before. I don't, I don't have an inclination against it, but it's not like yeah, my thing. yeah, not my thing. Not my thing. Yeah. You do you, whatever yeah. you, mostly whatever you want to do, but no illegal stuff, guys. Dipping, dipping, and popping. I like you're like spreaded toesies. That's always spreaded funny. Spreaded toesies. I just thought, that's, that's, all, that's what I imagine. Whenever you do that, I just think about toe beans. Like, I think about cats. Oh, like cat? Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's just got to be a cat thing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah if we're going deep, deep, deep dive. Um, I'm great. I've been with the kids all week. You have a cool new shirt with a... I, look at the shirt. Look how gold this is. It's beautiful. I'm wearing it tomorrow to the zoo. Right. If well, we can go. I don't know what the weather's going to be like tomorrow. but uh, It's supposed to be cold and... Uh, cold's fine. Maybe rainy. It gets, it's supposed to get up to sixty though, according to the weather from today. The you know the that's fine with me. If it's, we'll see how it is. It's also supposed to rain blood. Oh, so don't wear anything that you don't want to get stained. Yeah, this blood. would not be good. In, this would not be good in blood. So that's that circus for you though, right, guys? Yeah, There's blood <laughs> raining from the sky. Circus anywhere. Uh, uh, let's talk about some news, guys. Uh, RIP. We have an RIP. Sad message. Speaking of blood, Gilbert Godfrey passed away, sixty-seven years old. Um. R.I.P. Gilbert. Do we have? Do we do an impression before? I could do an impression of Gilbert Godfrey, of course. That's my best. Crazy, sorry. Be better. My best impression of Gilbert Godfrey is Gilbert Godfrey having sex. Let's hear it. Oh my God! It's the best! It's the best I've ever had! It's the hey, best! I hey, love it! Yeah, 
Yeah, he would. He definitely yeah. would repeat. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How about you? Al? I think this is the best. I never die when I'm happy. Oh my god, when I'm happy. Oh. Yeah. I didn't know it was a Gilbert Gottfried has sex thing, but okay. Jesus Christ. No, but imagine that. That's you. all you have to R. do. R.I.P. We'll pour one out yeah. not on this table. I'm gonna drink. I'll pour it in my mouth. I pour one out into my gullet. Um, all right, Peter. Funny guy. I mean, definitely went at his actual time, though, I bet. Like, he's, he's lived a hard life. I mean, there's no way that guy has lived a, a mild I mean, life. I'm just thinking of all the booze he's drank. It's probably been a, enough. Oh, you want me to open these? I thought that's ready? why they were here. Oh, I just... We got the Gummies. 100th anniversary Gummy Haribo bears. Gummy Bears. They have, they have the pineapple and watermelon flavor. Which one do you want to try or both? Yes. Yeah. Well, do we have a plate or anything? Well, no, I don't want to talk about some news, news, guys. Yeah, talk about some news. Guys, did you, first off, did you guys watch the Stranger Things for trailer? Stranger Things, I'm talking about Stranger Things. So we had a, a full on 80s trailer going on. Uh, picture of the villain who's like a creepy undead guy with like tentacles in his back. Yeah, he looking like shit. Fuck that guy. Why? Why do they keep like up in their no factor? Like, stop. Because it's scary, man. It's a scary show. But no, no. Okay, no. We got to see. We got to see. Yeah. We got to see Eleven trying to adjust to life, and she probably has a real name now. Hopefully, Katie. I don't know. Yeah, he's like a real name for it. It's like a real name, though. It's like a real 80s name. I mean, People in 1985 really liked that name. That's Katie's. So. Um, but uh, they showed like a, like a second of Hopper with his like buzz hair. The and, Hopper! Like, they showed a bunch of, a lot of the kids just like reacting to things that weren't there. They kept doing this, though. Bing, 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 uh, bing, a lot of Bing Wolfhard, because he picked that name. That's his name. I can pick a stage name, then I pick Finn Wolfhard. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it looked fun. I'm ready. It's working for, for him. It's been it's been too long since the last season, so let's get it going. It has been. I'm ready for this. I What's mean, the release date though? I don't know. Oh wow. The last season was like a little boring for me. Blackluster. Oh. Yeah, because they're like we're dating now. Everyone's like got relationships, and it's like let's go to the mall. You, you don't and watch I'm just these. Like, these used to be in the 80s, though. No, right? but also, these people should all have severe PTSD from everything right. they've no, been you're correct. through. You're correct on that. And they're just, Hopper's the only one displaying like, anything like that. Can you imagine, like, that. like, you're 11, and you see... Oh, that's her. That's and her. I mean, 11 years old. Oh, yeah, that's And her. you see, like, a horrible tentacle monster... And then you have People to live die. the rest of your life. Yeah. But then also, you're... But even just seeing that throwing monster. up, like, weird eggs into a sink. Yeah. Like, you never get over Yeah, it. no. Like, I you feel so do. bad for him. He's, like, like, like fucked for the rest of his life. Like, yeah. No, yeah. but, of course, if some kid was spitting, like, <laughs> weird eggs into the sink, he'd also just want to be playing D&D &D with his friends all the time, right? That's all you want to do, right? Yeah, like, this, it's broke. Yeah. Like, it, these kids are all broke. Yeah. Even yes. an adult, you'd be broke if you saw you this are, shit. You guys are making this a little too realistic. Sure, it's, I it's guess like, so. These movies. Yeah. are all dumb. Look at the Goonies. Look at any of those movies. Well, then I need None of them a Johnny sense. Five robot, like robot. Um, there might be a robot. Who knows? Um, I need a Huey Lewis and a news song. I mean, that's it's almost guaranteed. Yeah. That's what I need. And uh, Christopher Lloyd maybe guest guesting in an episode. I mean, we've got Carrie Elwes. I so. mean, I think Christopher Lloyd. I think Christopher Lloyd actually is the monster. But no, that would make sense. Like yeah. Christopher Lloyd now, yeah. Well, I mean, is that old? Yeah. Like, this is just what I look like. I'm not even a monster. Great Scott. Okay, I, I'm ready for it. Um, I am cautiously optimistic, as one would be, um, with, with not seeing this for so long. But do it. Let's see what let's see what they can do. Um, have you seen this new Witcher three season three casting? They cast three or four new four. Cast four. I only saw two. Um, one was Meng Her Zhang, who was playing a character named Milva. Who is that? I don't know. I do. It's actually, it's, uh, the person that plays Chang Chi's sister. Yeah. Zhu Zing Liang. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. I can see it right now. Uh, how about Hugh Skinner? Do you know who Hugh Skinner is? Well, he's, uh, Principal Skinner's son. He's Prince Ra Radovid. 
That's who he's playing. So uh, I'm assuming no, a, bad, a bad guy. A bad guy. I'm yeah. assuming he's gonna be a bad guy. Um, Christelle Elwin is Mistel, and that's what she looks like. I don't know what she was in before this, but also a Katie favorite, Robbie Mel. And it's not as because of the CW. Gallatin. It's because of Upload on Amazon. No, it's God, upload. no. It's, 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 it's called Upload? Yeah, yeah, Upload. Is that really what it's called? Yeah, it's yeah. Upload. Oh my God, I thought Have it was you watched Upload? You watched better. it, right? No. Oh, somebody told me they watched it. There. No, um, it's... I We've talked I, about that, this before. I still like life a little bit, like, yeah. so I'm not going to watch this shit. <laughs> <laughs> right, no, I love him because of those myself now. Cartoon Network live-action Scooby-Doo movies that they made, and I that I used to watch with the kids when they were younger, and he played Fred, and I love him. And then he was also in this he TV show... He played Fred? Yeah. What? Why did I not know that? He, he, was, al- he also played um, uh, Chris Redfield in... Um, uh, he did play that in, yeah. uh, in Resident yeah, Evil. Yeah. yeah, and he also was in this one season TV show called like uh-huh. Hail to the Chief uh-huh. or something like that. Run where the Chief. Where no, where um, uh-huh. uh, who was the president in uh in Independence Day? Uh, Bill, Bill Pullman Bill plays the president again. Why he's not? like the, he's the president, and I think. I'm trying to remember who was the first lady. Why have we watched this? Is that no? It's a oh my god! It's a one. It's a one season TV show. It's great. It was Josh Gad's first role. You you should have also Josh Gad plays his son, and he's fantastic. You should have said the male lead in Lake Placid, of course. Right, of course. Plus, I liked it because it came out like I want to say like five years ago. But like one of the daughters is like interested in another girl, and the stepmom is like. She just totally terror. takes it in stride. She's like, that's great, you know? And, like, the daughter, his older daughter is, like, pregnant at, like, 22. So, like, that's a big deal. And it's, like, how they have to deal with, you know, the like, yeah, what the country thinks of them. And the Secret Service. No. Uh, anyway, sorry. We went off on a tangent. It's a great show. Yeah. So. Tangent. We, but we never do tangents, guys. We never do them. Never. It's, wow. Wow. Well, Speaking of never doing tangents. This show has gone this many weeks without a tangent. No, we just we didn't even side right yeah. back. Ding. Put it in the back. Uh, guys, Matt Mickelson says that James Mangold's Indy, Indy 5 vision is similar to Steven Spielberg. Okay. He said, this this is going to feel similar to the Raiders of the Lost Ark, those uh, serials from the 1940s that you really like loved and that you loved, why the reasons you loved yeah. Raiders of the Lost Ark and Temple of Doom sure. would be the reason why you love this new indie movie. So do you think this is going to take place in the 40s? It's going to be like the 70s, right? It's got to be. He's old right? Now. Yeah. He's so old. He's so old. They're going to take like psychedelics or something. <laughs> okay. Just see, they're going to do the de-aging on, on Harrison Ford. And like, yeah, I'm younger now. No, I hope they general. de-age him completely the whole time. I'm a baby. What, oh, they think that like de-age him too as a baby. I hope they de-age Mad Mickelson for no reason. Like, I, I, I didn't know who he was. He was a um, character. I am also a baby. This I'm a baby. Why? 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 I'm a yeah. That's how you shot his baby anyway. Yeah. Um, we still don't know who Mads Mikkelsen's character is. I'm assuming he's a villain, just because his face. But um, who knows? Do we think he's a heroic lead of some no. sort? Or he could foil? be. Maybe he's a short round. Okay. Oh, Indy, watch out. My pinches of power. I, I, I have slick shoes. <laughs> slick you shoes, have slick shoes? I have pinches of power. Oh, bully blind is not so good. <laughs> the batteries go out. <laughs> <laughs> I can quote every line from that movie. Yep. Yeah, we did our ours yeah. was Goonies actually. So you. Were... No, he says. There yeah, was no pinch of power. Right? No, you were right. Oh, okay. ours was from Goonies. Yeah. No, what are you talking Slick about? Slick shoes and pinch of power from Goonies. From Goonies, yeah. So we're bully blinders. Oh. He has the, the lights in I'm his jacket you, you and they come out. Of Doom, I no, I no. was doing bully blinders. He still had like they had they made him have like an Asian okay, accent okay, in Dr. that Jones. movie. Yeah, even though he was like. An American kid, you know. Oh, you don't need Dr. Jones. Because, you know, um, they had one Asian kid with an accent and no black kids, right? Of course. That is, I'm glad we did that tangent. That was weird. <sighs> I only got one thing left. So yeah, talk about your news, yeah. I guess. Guys, I have some great news. I don't okay. Know what you do. So, have you thought, like, I want to see a movie that's 800 hours long? <laughs> We kind of just did. We just watched yeah. one. It was, it was all Fantastic so, Beasts. The Secret to Top Gun Maverick's director says there's 800 hours of footage shot. What? Fuck you. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody wants that. Get out of here. He basically said like they were doing 12 to 14 hour days and that they've been doing it for, since they started like five years ago or whatever. And he's like, we got, sometimes, some days we only use 30 seconds of footage for those 12 hour shot. What are they doing wrong that they're doing that? First of all, how much are they paying these guys? Like, 
Hey, you have to work for five years on this fucking movie. I'm like, yeah, no. No, I'm but good. seriously, you're doing it wrong. If you're use it working a 12-hour day and you can only use 30 seconds of that footage, you're fucking shooting that film it, incorrectly. It, his humble brag was we shot more footage than the three Lord of the Rings movies. I'm like, oh, but, fuck I mean, this you. Movie, for though, one boy, shitty movie. movie. <laughs> That's what I get for that. Some no, but he, what you know, the, you know what the truth is, is that Val Kilmer went on set a lot and just took all of his personal videos, and that's hey, really hey, the footage hey that they're talking about. Here. Oh, he doesn't sound like that anymore. He's fucked. He's got no, like, he's got the, yeah, like, he's the, got the thing. thing. Yeah. So he had throat ah, cancer. What was, it? what was that movie? It was a great movie. No, it's his movie. It. It like, um, it's called Val. Yeah, okay. and it's and it's he actually he would bring his camera with him. Val was like the first. He, like, one of the first celebrities that recorded his whole life. Like, he, as soon as he, from a kid, he, like, got a movie camera, and he'd bring it with him everywhere, and he'd take yeah. videos behind he was, the scenes, but he and like, just, like, all over the place. Obviously, and... no one saw it. He was recording, but he did it in this battle documentary. He played all of it, and he goes up to where he is now, which is not great. Like, his, I mean, he's mentally so he's in a better place, yeah, but, like, he had throat a cancer, place. and it wasn't the cancer that fucked up his throat. It was the, um, the treatment. Throat. Oh. The treatment killed his, his vocal cords completely. So um, his br- his son actually narrates it. It's a pretty, it's a really good movie. You guys should watch it. He talks during it, but it's not. It's not good. Yeah, it's no, rough. No, so no. I go to narrate this part. Yeah. But anyway, I could see him, you know, being on set and then just taking millions of hours of footage, or not, because this movie sounds like it's gonna be garbage. Yeah, trash. So, so we're watching it in the theater. Forty X. <sighs> well, you have to see a Forty X, right? Like, it's playing, it's flying through the hand. Only if they Only if it goes to Mach 1 and I get, like, a G-Force <laughs> where I pass out, like... And the seats have, you know, like, you can pee in the seats, right? Because if it's going to be... You can pee in the seats. Hey, you could pee in any seat. Okay? Yeah. I so could pee in... I'm peeing right now, guys. <laughs> guys, it's 20 bucks for a movie. You can pee in the <laughs> seats. <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, don't pee in the seats. That's rude. <laughs> That's uh, guys, Brian, <laughs> Brian Coogler, the uh, director of uh, the Black Panther. Co- I mean, basically, like the writer and creator of the Black Panther movie, yeah, yeah. too. Uh, but also the director of uh, Black Panther Two is joining Ironheart as an EP. As okay. A, as a okay. Uh, that is a great thing. I think. I think it's the only. I think so too. That's a good idea. We we need to kind of get some of these Marvel movies. I think uh, Marvel shows a little back on track here with. Uh, because, cause I, I, you know, I can tell you some things. I, I have some thoughts about Moon Knight. I like Moon Knight, for the record, but there's some things I'm like... Have you, have you seen the third episode already or not? No. I've only watched the first two episodes. Uh, we'll talk about it off here because I don't want to spoil anything. You know, but there was something that was just like, the fuck? And maybe... And maybe, also maybe, what? Maybe you guys can explain But also, the fuck? Um, but, yeah. um, yeah. Great. Ready for that. Uh, another, another, another big thing. Uh, let's go here, guys. Keep rolling. Ghost of Tsushima movie adaptation finds a screenwriter. So yeah. this is going forward. I didn't see this. This is great. I knew it was going to go forward. Uh, <laughs> video game movies I mean, are actually... We also knew that other things are going forward. It took like seven more years. But video game mm-hmm. movies right now and video game adaptations are, are what Marvel was 15 years ago, 10, 15 years ago. Yeah. They're, they know what they're doing now. They know how to I mean, look at those Sonic them. movies, right? Uh Jim Carrey's biggest opening was Sonic 2. It does make me think of... In the history of Jim Carrey. Yeah. Think of all the great movies he's done. Sonic 2. Let's say them right now. Cable right. Guy. Uh, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective. Man in the Moon. Ace Ventura, uh, Pet Detective 2. Uh, 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 Eternal Sunshine and Spotless Mind. Oh! Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. At the same time. <sighs> you guys are insane. Because I was trying to think of his movies that were actually like Liar, very... Liar, Liar, it's Liar. gonna be me. Um, yeah, Liar, you're Liar. thinking of like, Bruce Almighty. Bruce Almighty. Oh my god, that's a good one. What? This is the biggest movie! Oh, so, so um, video game screen adaptations are in their golden age right now. So you're saying you can't wait um, for the Chris Batman Pratt... Batman Forever. Uh, the, the Chris Pratt uh, Mario Brothers movie coming up. Oh, yeah. It's-a me! Mario! I mean, Chris Pratt! Because I'm doing my normal voice, I guess. Also, uh, Christianity is really cool. Maybe we should all join this Christian oh, cult. I mean, I mean uh, church. Ha ha! Ha ha! I'm going to hit a brick! No, and I hate, I love how, I, well, I hate how everyone's like, oh, he dropped Anna Faris, and it's more like, Anna Faris was probably like, I don't want to be a part of this, thank you, thanks, bye. Like, and he's like, I'll date a sports thing, so it's like, hey, you can date me, yeah. that's me, I'm a daughter, I'm a daughter, like, and I watch every other show, right, like, that'd be pretty awesome. Oh, God. Um, you're dating my daughter, these are the rules. 
No, and well, then, like, I'm, I'm and then like, his, his bastard kid comes in every once in a while, and they're like, oh, yeah, that's like Josiah or whatever. I'm also, oh, yeah, I'm a bastard child. A good or not, oh, I'm your son. It reminds me of when it came out, and everyone was like, that lady was so ugly. I can't believe he was sleeping with her. And it's like, oh, my God, I hate all of America. You're all the worst. Please. Please. Like I'm a penis, so it's just all okay. Yeah, let me go. No, it's 100%. Yep, yep. <laughs> Guys, I got yep, one yep. last thing here. Okay. okay. It is, is, is it the same thing I have? It might be the biggest news I'll say if we got ever of all time. Hasbro acquires it's not the good. And you're mm-hmm. like, wait, what does that mean? Hasbro owns Wizards of the Wizards of the Coast. Yeah. The creators of the Dungeons and Dragons mm-hmm. system. So Which means that now toys, 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 so toys, 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 toys. I, well, toys. Toys, toys, no, no, no. Do you, oh. do you think behind is the digital version that already we already thought digital that was... toys, toys, mm-hmm. digital toys? Maybe. Um, uh, this is the thing that like like didn't they already own these guys? Like, no, I guess not. But, but so they they finally bought okay. the D and D Beyond system, which has been doing D and D for. Does that mean we're gonna see a Joe Hamada comic book like uh, of uh, the D and D? No, this just means cross? that D and D and D and D Beyond okay. are now the same thing. Oh, as opposed cool. to being two different things that we didn't, we already thought they were the same thing anyway. No, that was real big news. So it's just like it's like having peanut butter next to chocolate and then being like, oh, these are good together. Mm-hmm. No. Uh, but but the the uh, uh, Wizards of the Coast said that they're not going to do any changes. So if you guys already have accounts out there, we you know, know. You guys, some of you guys out there are nerds. Um, not this guy. Not us. I'm really cool. Look at this guy. He's, he's very cool. I'm wearing a goldenrod shirt. So I mean, goldenrod. Today I was told that I'm literally ex- accepted as a man. So it's, sounds good. Well, you do have a penis, though. I think that's mm-hmm. pretty. Good. I guess that's part of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, hey guys. Yeah. I'm the last thing. thing. I have the last thing. Guys, Pedro Pascal has not finished the last of his games. He hasn't finished them. Uh, the lead actor playing Joel in the Last of Us uh, um, movie or uh, show. He's like, so what happens to my character? Well, basically, he's movie. like, I want. He's like, I want to avoid <clears throat> imitating Troy Baker. He's like, I know Troy Baker's character is iconic. He's like, I know that my. I want my character to be nice, and, but I want it to feel like how um, John Favreau has treated the Mandalorian, where like he's picking the epic parts. Out of the Star Wars, but also making his own. He's like, that's what I want to do with this character. Um, Smash toys. Yeah, he's like, well, he's like, um, he said this treatment preserves the iconic moments while brings surprises. That's what he's Ooh. he's feeling should be important. And you know what? I agree. As long Major as he's Pascal, not blonde, I'm fine with that. So, so you're <laughs> saying Joel and Bill should get together? That's probably what happens. Shipping yeah. Shipping. We're, we're shipping Jill. No, that would make it. Bowl. That's worse. No, it doesn't work. The shit does not work. So. But he said there's going to be surprises. So, okay, show show me what you got. Because I'm really... You have you had me at you're doing a Last of Us what, show. What if they kill off Jacob the first episode? Oh, God. I mean, that could be the... They could be doing Last of Us 2 in it. There's no way that's happening. No. No. No, it's not. They, gotta, they have to build no. up to her like breakdown. But she's just a broken. If they're person. if they're ch- loosely also following seven years later, if they're loosely following the games, they have to kill them off season two or three, right? Spoilers, guys. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Loosely. That's if they're loosely doing it. So I show me what you got. I'm exactly Peter Pascal is a great actually, actor. Matt, they would have to kill is if you know, seasons are normally a year in the life, so like you would have to kill off to like season five. I mean, she's 19. We will see. We'll see where they go. But I'm still excited to see where they're going to go. Um, I hope they get all of the the, the voice actors, uh, at least, like, bit characters in there. Like, they Ashley Johnson walks in and goes, good luck, or something like that, you know. Uh, Dude, what if Nolan like, North just shows up? I'm like, what? He's, the name of... oh, He's like, David. He's David. You're Boy, right. We get Nolan North to play David. He was yes. David. Like, oh, that guy he got was probably... David. Right. Like it was gonna rape someone. Probably. What if? What if he was just the ghost, the ghost from uh, Destiny? <clears throat> and that wizard came the wizard, from the moon. The wizard came from the moon. Hey, um, that wizard came from the moon. Hey, uh, that's all I got, guys. That wizard came from the moon. Remember hey. Destiny? Thank you for stopping by. I he still does. play it. He does. He's still playing it. No, I was gonna say like the first. Didn't How they make a movie? That is.